Cats are very much like humans, in that they also get sick. Cats are susceptible to various diseases, and some of these diseases are contagious. If you have a cat, it is important to know what to do if your cat gets sick. The most common ailment that cats get is diarrhea. This can be caused by a number of things, including food poisoning and parasites. The best way to prevent this from happening is to keep your cat's diet clean and healthy. You should also make sure that your cat has regular vet visits so that it can be monitored for any signs of illness. Another thing that cats get sick with is fleas. Fleas can cause a great deal of discomfort for your cat and can even lead to severe health problems. To prevent this from happening, you should make sure that you vacuum at least once a week. If your cat has fur, you should also comb it regularly and make sure that it is not matted. If you have a cat and it is sick, there are a number of things that you should do. First, you should take your cat to the veterinarian. It is important that you bring the animal with you so that the vet can properly diagnose the problem. Once the diagnosis is made, you should also treat the problem immediately. There are a number of medications that can help your cat recover from a variety of illnesses. If your cat is sick, you should contact your vet to find out what medication would work best for your pet. There are many different kinds of medications available, and each one has its own set of benefits and drawbacks. Before you buy any medication, you should consult your vet first. It is important to note that cats often have difficulty recovering from sickness. They may refuse to eat, or they may vomit several times before they will actually begin to heal. Cats are also more prone to infection, and they often need to be treated with antibiotics. You should also keep your cat away from other animals while it is sick. Cats can carry harmful bacteria, and other animals can pass them on to your cat. It is important that you avoid having your cat come into contact with other animals until it is completely well. Your cat may also experience a loss of appetite while it is sick. This is because cats are natural hunters, and they often lose their appetite when they are sick. You should try to feed your cat as normal as possible, but you should also make sure that it eats smaller portions than usual. It is important that you keep your cat safe while it is sick. Your cat can easily become stressed, and it may even start to scratch itself. You should make sure that it does not have access to any sharp objects, and that it is kept away from any other animals. You should also make sure it is comfortable, and that it has plenty of room to move around. If your cat is sick, you need to take it to the veterinarian. If your cat is suffering from diarrhea, you should keep it hydrated with water. You should also keep it warm and protected from drafts. Your cat may also need an antibiotic to fight off any infections that it might be suffering from. If your cat has fleas, you should make sure that it is treated with an insecticide spray. You should also remove the hair from around its face so that it can breathe easier. Your cat may also need to be bathed, and you should also keep it clean. If your cat gets sick, you should keep it safe and comfortable. If it is suffering from diarrhea, you need to make sure that it stays hydrated. You should also keep it protected from drafts. You should also make sure your cat is warm and that it has plenty to move around. Your cat may need an antibiotic to fight off infections, and you should also make sure that your pet is bathed and cleaned up. If your cat has fleas, it needs to be treated with an insecticide spray.